All right, Waco's had a couple scattered showers here. Knocked you down from 97 to 92. Feels like 98 degrees. Yeah, hot, steamy Father's Day here. Got an east wind at 14 miles per hour. And still got some of the gray skies here with some sunshine breaking through. We've had some showers in the area in Temple and Bell County. Feels like 100. Temperatures down a couple degrees, sitting at 90. Here's a live look at Doppler Net here over the last couple of hours. We've seen scattered showers approach Temple. Most of the activity staying on the north side, some down around the Bell County, Williamson County line. Most of the activity east of I-35 today. Got some more showers and thunderstorms around the I-45 uh, corridor. We'll keep with some spotty, isolated to scattered showers and thunderstorms over the next couple of hours. Overall dissipating as we go through the evening. Can't roll out an isolated shower, sprinkle or two overnight tonight. And then we'll really do this again tomorrow. We've got this disturbance down here in the western Gulf. Overall, this energy is going to continue to lift off towards the north the next several days. Very slow going and as it does so, just pumping in in even more Gulf moisture than we're already seeing. It's been humid several days. You're saying how could we get more? It's going to do it with daytime heating and this energy moving north going to give us chances for more isolated to scattered showers and thunderstorms over the next several days, at least the first half of the work week. Not looking at anything severe, but lightning gusty winds and very heavy torrential rainfall will be what we'll mainly be watching. You saw how it kind of has that little spiral bands uh, to it, it's kind of very tropical looking. As we go hour by hour, doing a good job focusing most of the scattered showers in our eastern areas. Everything continues off towards the west northwest going into 10 o'clock tonight. Everything dissipates, maybe an isolated shower. We'll hold on to partly to mostly cloudy skies going into the overnight, waking up cloudy again. Few sprinkles here and there first thing in the morning. And then if you didn't get any rain today and you're really desperate for some. You'll have another shot tomorrow. Very similar. We'll get the rains uh, again. The bands going from east to west to northwest as we go through the day and again, very isolated to scattered at most. So uh, just like we're seeing today, not everyone guaranteed to see some rainfall, but it'll be out there. Could be heavy at times and could even deal with some lightning at times with some of these as well. Overall, we'll see that kind of wind down a little bit in the evening, but going into Tuesday morning, going to run with about a 30% chance here of some overnight scattered showers and thunderstorms, not expecting anything severe. A lot of activity stays just to the south of us the next several days, and we're on the northern edge of it. Have to watch maybe some of our southern rows as we go into Tuesday and Wednesday for the possibility of more widespread rain, but right now, hour by hour here is going still more isolated to scattered on Tuesday, but the cloud cover should be much thicker Tuesday into Wednesday, and that could help keep temperatures down if the rain doesn't do it for us. We're going to overall stay with very similar conditions. Better rain chances off towards the east as we go through the day tomorrow. Spotty sprinkle can't be ruled out. Muggy 70s tonight. We're back into the 80s and lower 90s tomorrow with scattered showers and mostly cloudy skies. Uh, I couldn't remember what it was called. Summer. <laughs> I really couldn't think of the word. It kind of that's not good, man. That's summer not good. starts on Thursday is what I was trying to say, and it just went blank on me. But uh, yeah, we're going to hold on to some of those uh, isolated scattered rain chances the next several days. So we'll keep our fingers crossed for everybody out there to at least get one shower. Summer. It's a tough one. It was. A lot of things going on in here. <laughs> <laughs> well, you see that.